Hello, welcome to this video guitar tutorial about City of Light's worship song, Ancient of Days. This song begins with a piano introduction and then a verse where it's just piano accompanying the vocals. Then when we get to the chorus, we come in with a little bit of melodic work, playing something like this. So let me come a little bit closer and show you exactly what I was doing. So let's take a closer look at what I was playing for that melodic part there. So starting on the 5th fret on the B string, then going up to the 8th fret and then using my 3rd finger to push down the 10th fret. Then we're going up to the E string now to hit the 7 and then 8 and then 8, 7 back down to 10 on the B and then 8 on the B and sliding down to that 5th which we started on. So all together that part was... And then we start the same. But this time we stay on that 10 for a bit. And then 7. Now the next section begins the same. Now, to finish, we go to the 5th on the G string, so that was 5, 7, 9, 7, and then we're going to go 5, slide up to 9, and to 7, and then we do something a little bit different now, we're going to hammer on from the 5th fret to the 6th fret on the B, and we're going to have our index finger ready to press down on the 5th fret on the G string as well, and we're going to have the 8th fret uh, pushed down by our pinky on the E string. Sorry, let me try that again. And then 2nd finger off and finish on that 5th fret on the B string. Now let's turn our attention to the verse. So to start off with, we're going to be playing the 5th fret on the B string and we're going to go 5 down to 3, up to 6, back to 5, back to 6, down to 5, stay on 5, and then to 3. Okay, so that's the first part of the verse, and that's probably the simpler part. Then we're going to move down a little bit in pitch. We're going to be here. closer to show you the second half of the verse there. So we're starting 2nd fret on the D, then just taking it off and playing an open D, and then 2 again, then open G, and onto the 2nd fret. So... And then open G, back to that 2nd fret on the D, and then we're going... 3 on the A, open D, hammer on on the 2nd fret on the D, open, same thing again, and then we're going to play uh, kind of like a C shape, but we're going to suspend the 3rd here, so we're going to have our 3rd finger on the 3rd fret on the D, and then an open G, and we've got the 1st fret held down for the C note on the B string, and then we're going to take off that 3rd finger and have our 2nd finger ready to play the 2nd fret on the D. So all together that was...
So let's have a look at the chorus now. Uh, in the chorus, I'm going to be mostly playing chords, but I'll be playing them kind of in the middle of the neck area. So I'll be sounding something like this. and show you the shapes I was playing there. Okay, so when we get to the chorus, uh, we start on an F chord, and so I'll be playing that by barring my index finger across the 5th fret, and so, and also I'll put my 3rd finger here, so 7th fret on the D string, then I'm barring the 5th fret on the G string, and then I'll have my index finger, sorry, my 2nd finger down on the 6th fret on the B string. And then when I play an A minor next, I just need to take that finger off. And then it goes back to the F, so I just put that finger down again. And then we go to G. So we want to shift down and have our uh, third finger, fifth fret on the D. Second finger on the fourth fret on the G. And then uh, barring down on the third fret with our index finger. And then going back to uh, an A minor, so just shifting that forward to have that 7555 five, five shape. So that first part was... And then we go back to F, so put that second finger down again, A minor, and then sitting on that G, and you might want to arpeggio it a little bit. And then we go back to the F shape, A minor, F, G, A minor, and then F, and then to the G, uh, and then we're getting to, I think it goes back to a C, and we're leading into the guitar solo, which I'm about to show you. So let's look at how the guitar solo goes. Uh, I played this as the intro to this video. It sounds like this. <laughs> and show you exactly what I'm pressing down there. So we're on the D string. We've got two, five, seven, seven, nine, ten, and then a bend on the nine, seven, five, two. So that's the first part. to be playing octaves starting on a C so we've got three and five so three on the A five on the G and then we just shift it up two frets and then two more so three to five to seven back to the five and then back to the first one on the three and slide right up to the seven five and then finish on the three so that part all together was so we've got and there you have it so now you know all you need to know to play the lead guitar parts for City of Lights Ancient of Days Thanks for watching.